What's up, you guys? I just spent the last hour getting ready. And I still look like this, I know. Uh, because I have our Bar Bob Brigade Black Friday Cyber Monday shoot today. And, oh, bitch, I look good. Anytime I could bust these guys out, I'm so happy. I got these guys maybe three years ago. But look at this fit, though. Black camo rebirth shirt. I cropped it, of course. I just like cropping my own shirts, honestly. Um, I'll go to like Urban Outfitters or whatever, and then I see crop shirts, and I'm about to buy it, and I'm like, wait, why would I do that? I can just do that with my own clothes. So right now, I'm wearing a medium, um, and I crop it. And I like to crop it right underneath the Rebirth Barbell Brigade logo. But it just looks so good with these pants and then our Barbell Brigade hit on them. Look at this. I love, love, love black camo. You can't go wrong with it. They're pretty true to size. Uh, wait, I take that back. They're a little bit bigger when you buy them new, but once you wash them, they shrink a pinch. So then they become true to size. But okay, come on. You know I look cute. Okay, I don't ever do that. Come on. It's okay to boost your own ego up sometimes. So this is what I'm taking for my shoot. These are my shoes. Gonna bust out the freaking Jordans. I've only worn them once and it was literally for another shoot and I've never worn them again because I just like them so much. And then these are all the items that I'm gonna be modeling today. These are all the classics that we're bringing back. These are like our classics. Yeah, anytime we've, or the time that we released them, they sold out so quickly. And then there's so many people that are like, you need to bring it back, you need to bring it back. Guess what, baby? We're bringing them back just for Black, Fly uh, Black Friday and Cyber Monday. So make sure to get all the items that you didn't get before. And again, I cropped them because, you know, I'm a girl. I'm cute. I, um, I want to show off my midriff. And I like these sweats, you guys, mainly ladies, because they're high rise. So like if you got pudge down here, like that, don't worry. It's gone, baby. And now it looks like you have a six pack and you're all cute. Yeah, I like it. Okay, so I'm gonna get my... Did you get that? Okay, let me play it backwards. I'm gonna get my day started, pack all of this stuff because it's been steamed, cut, cleaned. These are underwear that don't fit me anymore. We can move this away from the shot. I don't know why I put myself on blast more than anyone else. Like you guys probably didn't even see that, didn't know what it was until I called it out. Why do I do this to myself? I don't know, but I did and I do. Now you know, I gotta go. All right, so this is my second outfit. Something more loungy. I do like gray on gray, but then I like pairing it with something kind of funky to make it pop because if you just add white or black, it's just like boring. So yep, this is the next look right here. We got Justin shooting me. What the hell? What are you doing out here, working? Yep. They got me locked up in this cubicle, working 24 seven. I don't see any sunlight. <laughs> exactly. All right, you guys, halfway through the photo shoot and I wanna show you this next one. Super simple fit, but again, I always like having that pop, right? So let me show you. So we got our classic hoodie here with the Barbell Brigade BBs in the back. I absolutely love this hoodie because it's so thick, super high quality. Honestly, I have Nike hoodies, hundreds hoodies, you name it, I have the brand, but I still, this is my favorite. This right here, these the ones we make, my absolute favorite. Okay, so I'm pairing it with white shoes, black tights, but they're not regular black tights. They're glitter black tights. That's the pop I'm talking about. So from afar, you look plain. When you get close, oh, bitch. Yes. What's this look? Ah! Alright, so I'm home now. Which means you already know. <laughs> wow, does this happen? Stop. What's in there? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he put it in there. Oh, 
put his shoes on by himself. Good job. Oh my god, you're so long. I saw that. What is up, you guys? Welcome to day two of this vlog. Um, I know yesterday's vlog was really, really short, but I really just spent my time modeling all our Barbell Brigade clothes for Black Friday, so please make sure to check that out because it's um, it's gonna be, it's the biggest sale of the year and it's honestly when you guys get the biggest discounts because we don't really do too many discounts. Um, but today is a special day because we're in our new office and I'm just kidding. I mean, yeah, this is our new office, but it's this guy's birthday and uh, we had said that we, we said we weren't gonna get any, uh, each other anything for our birthday because we bought each other laptops because we both needed laptops. So we got the laptops, but Papa's just been having the worst day ever or the worst the week ever. So I wanted to change that for him. So we're gonna do a little celebration in honor of his birth. That's very cute. What do you mean we? So it's not just you and me? Oh, oh me, 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 I am. Oh. I am. And the, so his luck transferred onto me because as I was driving here to the office, because we just finished filming our podcast. Yes, it's a new setting because we had to move our office. So it doesn't look the cutest, but it doesn't look that bad. And that sign is broken. Check out our last vlog so they can see what happened. But as I was getting up and heading this way, my stupid Tesla would not turn on. <sighs> I mean, fine. I've had it for two years. I've had zero issues, so maybe it's just maintenance that I have to do on it, but it just didn't turn on. I did charge it, so I don't know what's going on with that. My mom was kind enough to lend me her car, but we're done here, and now we're gonna head out to LA um, so that I can surprise Bart with his little gift. Look at all this. Look at this, look at this. Okay. Papa, do you know what your surprise is gonna be? <laughs> no, what is it? Do you have any idea? Uh, I have zero Really? Idea. Yeah. Swear. I swear, zero idea. Nice, look at this. Because you haven't given me any clues or anything like I that. I keep trying to tell you. I know, but I keep I trying, I'm like, do you, to do you want to know what it is? Do you no. want to know what it is? Because for once, I want to, because you know, both of us have a hard time keeping secrets. I know. So for once, I want to find out what something is on the day of. Because I already told you what your Christmas present is too. I know, I hate it. And it's like so early. It was literally me washing the dishes on a random Tuesday and he goes, Hey, do you want to know what I got you for your, for Christmas? And I'm like, no. I don't no. Really feel like that. I'm like, hey, babe, I can't take it anymore. Oh, I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what happened. Look, I'm driving my mom's car. Uh, I'm not used to it. It's a beautiful car. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Let's go get your surprise, you little booger. <laughs> you kidding me? I had to park my car, and I think I gave away the location. I told Papa we're going to a spa, but we'll see. Let's we'll see what kind of spot we're talking about. He has to change into his slippers. Have to wear masks, they take the turns. Look at this, so pretty. It's not my turn. Yes. I told Papa, you really, really gonna need this. And then he saw what it is and he goes, yes, I really do need this. It's pretty, the lobby's pretty. and I did need this because this week has been crazy. Oh, I love you. Thank you, Mama. Is it yummy? Oh yeah, it is yummy. Look how pretty this plate is. Oh, my favorite chocolate. Oh, this is a really good tea. It's really good. It's a citrusy, not too sweet, perfect with chocolate. Mm. All right, so we are in our room right now, and it's really, really cold. We're gonna get a couple's massage. That's what I found. More chocolate. You're hungry, huh? Yeah. And we're gonna get a foot massage. Look at that. And then we have our own bathtub and shower. Ah, Bart has no idea what's happening. Oh, we're actually gonna get to eat food, but he doesn't know that yet. Look at that. Okay, we're 
we're gonna get naked now. So they just gave us a foot massage while in like a hot water, yeah. Hot bowl of or a water of hot wait, a bowl of hot water and it was so good and that's just the feet. It that's was it. the best foot massage I ever had. Same. It was like just the perfect amount of pressure Same. where it's like right before it's about to hurt, you know? Yeah, but this was really off. really got in there. It was really good. Okay, now we're gonna do the body. So see you later. So we just finished the massage. Oh, that was so good. They start with your scalp. Oh. And then they do your back for, it feels like forever. This is the first time they were massaging my back where I'm like, okay, you can move on. Because it was just so much. Uh, what did you think? The lady massaged the crap out of my titties. Did the guy massage your titties? Yeah, like a peer though. He didn't go, he didn't do the nipple pinch that. Shut up. I'm <laughs> just kidding. I hate you. Was it good though? Is this the best thing you've ever done? I felt really good. It was a, uh, I started knocking out, but then she's digging her elbow into my back. So it was one of those where it's like, it's so painful, but it also feels good. Yeah. So I was like snoring and then going, oh, owie, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now it's sushi time. So, yay. Okay, so they actually turn on the lights so you guys can get a better view of the room. Everything's really pretty, really clean, but now, it's lunchtime and they brought us sushi and some tea. Look at that, some sashimi, a couple rolls. And then there's a teapot and it's like lit by a little candle. And then they brought us dessert here. I'm not sure what it is, but it was so cute. Is it more chocolate? Probably, she covered it. It was like this. Look at the presentation, I just- Oh, is this a cup of ice with something in it? Oh, maybe it's oh. lychee? Yeah. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Lychee. Okay, so we're gonna eat now. Happy birthday! Thank you, Mama. It's very relaxing. Yes! So we completely demolished everything. Everything was so good. We kind of have a hunch or an inkling that the sushi might be from Sugarfish, like that's how good it was. Really good. So now the next phase is we take a shower and then we go into the bath. Very Japanese style. And I'm here for it. How are you feeling? Very relaxed. And thank you so much. This is exactly what I needed. After all the nonsense that went on last week, it was crazy. But I feel very relaxed. And I feel like I could knock out any second. Yeah. Okay. I'm excited. Okay. Okay. So now we are again in the lobby. Remember this place? Yeah, we're back here and one more cup of tea before we hit the road. That's just what they gave us. And yeah. Happy oh, birthday! Thank you. <laughs> oh, cool. Cheesecake. Oh, cute. Awesome. Thank you. Cheesecake. You cheesecake. Wow. Yeah. That's so Happy cool. Happy birthday. Thank you. What is that? It's a little music box. Look. Oh, wait, where'd it go? Look at it. How cute. And it's a yuzu cheesecake. Ah, look at that. Okay, we go wish. <laughs> okay, go for the back. No, the, you in the plate and then blow it. I missed the first blow. Go. <laughs> e Happy birthday. Thank you, Mama Potato. Best. At least this, these candles you get to blow by yourself because the next candles it's all taika. True. <laughs> so I hope you made a wish. I did. I made two wishes but there's two candles. Hey, they're for you. Thank you. I'm at Baskin Robbins now. Getting Bart. The birthday cake that he gets me every year. I'm getting it for him this year. His favorite. Not mine. Today's Papa's birthday. I'm gonna eat it. Tell Papa happy birthday. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Oh, 
Thank I you. Eat We're gonna eat the dinner first and then that. Ooh, the infamous ice cream cake has returned. <laughs> Lillian, you make uni. I have that picture. <laughs> Why is it so funny? Because you, that's an inside joke. <laughs> Did you tell them where that inside joke came from? I think they know. Do they? Tell I don't them, think so. Tell them, tell them. So, as a lot of people know um, already from JK News Stories, that I had the worst birthdays pretty much growing up. One, I never got to keep my presents. The minute like my mom's friends would give me presents, I would open it and she would see the joy in my heart and that was an indicator of whether or not to pass it on. So if I saw like my favorite Nerf gun, that my mom would be like, oh, Bart likes it so much, just makes such a great present for someone else. So that present would immediately go to other people, so I never really got to have presents. Also, birthdays were never about me, it was always about my mom because she gave birth to me, so I usually That's spent- That's it should be. The moms should get the celebration for every kid, not the birth of the kid, like, okay. Yeah, so um, the way that we had it would be, I wake up and the whole day I serve my mom on my birthday and I would get on my knees and bow like 10 times and tell my mom how much of a blessing it was to have a great mom like her. And so I never had birthdays, it was always about my mom. And so that cake is an inside joke because let me find this picture for you let's see where is it there it is so this picture is when i turned four my mom got me a birthday cake that said happy birthday with both me and her name and her oh, age on it name. and what's funny about that is our birthday isn't even in the same month but because the birthday is to celebrate her, my birthday cake had her name on it. And it has that too. So that's very, very cuny. Thank you, mama, for bringing back that childhood trauma. Anytime, baby, that's not here. What's wrong, mister? You want cake? What's going on? You don't want cake? No, we gotta eat. Okay. Oh. All right, we've been waiting. Good job, high five. Whoa! Good job, mister. We've been waiting for Taika to finish eating Here, drink your water, so that we can finally the eat the cake and the cake's kind of melting a little bit, but Taika did it. And now we can all sing happy birthday to Papa. Thank you. Okay, let's go. I'm Monkey, Grandma's it. talking to you. Hurry or we're still waiting on you. Can you move the water, please? You know what? He can just go to the room and not eat anything. Yeah, well, he can go to bed. Maybe he's just thirsty. No, let's just take it. That's a good one too. Okay, you, okay. Can, scarf a you can put it on, on his thing. Ooh. This? Yeah, but put it on his thing so he can... What do you mean? Who's gonna blow it out? You are? Oh, he's gonna blow it out? Okay. Yeah, why not? Okay, cool. You wanna blow out the candles? For yeah. Papa's birthday? Three. Three of them? Okay. Don't blow it out yet. We're gonna have to sing first, okay? Let me give you this water too. Careful. I don't want you to... Don't touch oh, it. Oh, you just did that. Okay, don't touch it. Don't touch it. Papa okay. already touched it. We got the cool lighter. Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Papa. Happy birthday to you. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Good job. <laughs> Good job. All right, y'all, on that note, thank you so much for joining us and making Bart feel so loved on his birthday. He received <laughs> he received all of your beautiful messages on Instagram, DMs, everywhere you sent them, he got them. Say thank you to the good people. That thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all the well wishes. And, uh, and I love them, I really do, because uh, I need them this year. <laughs> yeah, look at that, look at that. Okay. Bye, guys.